Hi, I'm Brett Collins with BC Live, and today we're checking out the Teradek Bolt 3000. As experienced users of the Teradek Bolt Pro 2000 series, we were ecstatic to get our hands on the new units to see what's changed. As the product title suggests, the unit is now rated for a distance of 3000 feet. For this test, we found a nice long bike track on top of a dam with a clear, unobstructed view. We've pre-marked distances on the path using these cones. If you've seen our range test with the Bolt Pro 2000, you'll see that we tried with and without the antenna array attached to the receiver. We're going to echo that same test here and see where we end up. Out of the box, the 3000 gets us right up to around 3000 feet before starting to show breakup. Adding the antenna array to the mix bolsters the range and we're back up to a completely usable signal right up to around 3500 feet. Keep in mind, if you want to take the units this far, it's a good idea to keep the transmitter and the receiver still for the strongest possible signal. Don't forget to also get the units nice and high to maintain a good clear line of sight. The reality is, more often than not, you're going to have to deal with crowds, walls, and other obstructions. So why don't we take a look at a real world example. We recently worked on a project called Robocon, which is one of the first interactive live action video games. The idea here was to wirelessly transmit a camera strapped to an avatar's chest for a first person point of view. Although this basement was only 300 foot squared, it was inundated with concrete walls and set design pieces, which made getting back to the control room wirelessly a significant challenge. We used two Teradek Bolt 3000 receivers and placed them strategically throughout the basement. The combination of the extra channels, rapid reconnect, and sheer signal strength is really what made this feat possible. So let's circle back to some of the other new features in the 3000. Reconnect times have been vastly improved, and as we all know in high pressure situations, seconds count. I'm pleased to say that after working with them for four consecutive days and testing up to 12 hours a day, we didn't need to cycle power even one time. Some other features include HDMI to SDI conversion on the transmitter, two new DFS channels, and 20 MHz options on the 3000 model, which allow more than twice the number of units to connect in the same area without causing interference. And for those of us who love to stay organized, there's also a removable top cap which can be color coded to show which TX and RX combos are in use on set. Thanks for watching our review of the Teradek Bolt 3000. For rentals or sales or for more info on our workflow at Robocong, check out our blog on bcliveproductions.com.